piece of wisdom that I'm, I'm pretty sure your mama did not tell you. They say dog is man's best friend. I say the egg is because you can eat it like breakfast, lunch, or dinner. You know what I mean? <laughs> the best ever herby potato omelet that is so satisfying you can eat it breakfast, lunch, or dinner. We're gonna start with three gold potatoes right here. And we're gonna peel them up, no big deal. And we're gonna dice them up real small. Okay, next we're gonna go for some green onions. Two large garlic cloves. We're gonna mince them, no big deal. We're gonna take these veggies, cook them up in the skillet. Meanwhile, we're gonna heat our oven to 375 degrees for this baked omelet. Potatoes gonna potato. <laughs> Extra virgin olive oil, the start of everything delicious. We're gonna wait for it to shimmer. Potatoes, garlic, and onion going in. Medium high-ish heat. Going in with a nice big pinch of kosher salt. And then we have a foursome of warm Middle Eastern spices that are going to blow your socks off. Starting with coriander. One teaspoon of Aleppo. A little bit of paprika. And a touch of turmeric. But you gotta be very careful with it. You just need a tiny pinch. Toss this party around here. Good things are happening. Let it cook for five to 10 minutes, turning it low to medium-ish heat and then covering it will allow the potatoes to steam from within and cook real well. A little bit of parsley, about a half a cup or so. Bunch it up, chop like a pro. Next, some fresh dill. We like us some herby eggs. We're gonna crack some eggs. Can I do it without looking? Let's see. I got it! We're gonna crack a good, oh, six or seven of them. Pinch of kosher salt. Gonna let you in on a secret I learned from my mom. A dash of baking powder will fluff up your eggs and they will be delicious. Grab a whisk and have at it. All right, we're gonna throw in our herbs, dill and parsley and mix them all up. Oh yes, these potatoes are ready. Pour the egg mixture all over right here. What we're watching for is for the sides and the bottom to settle just a little bit, then we're moving it to the oven for, oh, eight minutes or so. This potato omelet is perfectly ready. It's fluffy. The edges are bubbling. I cannot wait. This is exactly the kind of food I like to make when I'm so tired but need something hearty and delicious. Loads of flavor right here, you guys. Grab the recipe for my herby potato omelet over on themediterraneandish.com. I will see you later. Ciao. Mm-hmm.